before the biggest news of cryptocurrency history happens, the halvening of Bitcoin itself, I'm going to show you the easiest way to buy cryptocurrency from your phone or from your laptop. I'm Zeke and welcome to the Dream Green Show. Let's get into it. Welcome back YouTube. I'm going to show you two simple ways to buy Bitcoin from your phone or from your laptop. And if you want to find out why I think Bitcoin is going to go up in the near future because of the happening having where Bitcoin gets pretty much the payouts get cut in half. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out why I think Bitcoin is going to go up in the future and what it has done on the last couple of happenings that had happened in the past and on this last couple of bull runs that happened. All right, so let's get straight into it. The app that I use is called Coinbase. All you have to do is go to your app store and type in Coinbase, all right? So here it is on the app store in the Apple uh, store and then I believe it's also on Android. Uh, it has pretty good reviews, 79, um, 791,000 reviews all with uh, positive re reviews for the most part with a 4.7 star rating. I remember back in 2017 when Bitcoin was shooting up from $15,000, $18,000. Uh, Coinbase was just so flooded with so many users that if you did not already sign up for Coinbase before the bull run happened, it was going to be hard, very, very hard to get an account at the time. So it might be good just for future proofing yourself to just go ahead and set up an account. It's completely free to set up an account. And if you do deposit money into your account, you get a free extra $10 if you click the link down below. So if we go into our, my Coinbase account. I'm going to show you guys the easiest way to buy cryptocurrency uh, that I have found from your phone. All right, so we're here inside my Coinbase account. Right now I have $1,961 worth of cryptocurrency in my account. If I click on portfolio, I'll show you guys exactly what I have. I have about 35 cents in cash. Bitcoin, 1, I have 0.156 um, worth of Bitcoin, which is around $1,062. I have some Litecoin in here, around 17 Litecoin. Ethereum, I have um, about 0.5 Ethereum. Some Bitcoin SV, some Ripple, which is XRP. And then the other coins on here that you can also buy through your Coinbase account. If you click on Bitcoin for my portfolio and go down, you can look at the market cap, which is $124 billion. The volume today so far is $38 billion. Um, the trade activity is 75% buy, 25% sell. And the typical hold time for people investing in Bitcoin is around 94 days. Bitcoin price is currently sitting at $6,780. So let's get right into it. And I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to buy Bitcoin using Coinbase. All you have to do is link Coinbase to your bank account or to your credit card and just simply hit trade, buy Bitcoin with cash. Uh, today I'm going to purchase $200 worth of Bitcoin. Preview buy. And there it goes, um, I'm, it's gonna be a $2.99 um, Coinbase fee. That's how they make that money. But it's still cheaper than most ways of buying Bitcoin. So I'm going to hit buy now. And once I buy now, I'm instantly able to trade it on Coinbase. So hit buy now. This will be for 0 0.028909972 worth of a Bitcoin. So you don't have to buy a full Bitcoin. You could buy fractions of the Bitcoin if you want to start investing with cryptocurrency. And there it goes, guys. I have successfully purchased 0.289 worth of Bitcoin and it is now inside my Coinbase account. I'm able to buy and sell uh, Bitcoin. I can also buy things using Bitcoin. So let me show you how to buy things using Bitcoin. So if you want to buy things using Bitcoin, you just click on your BTC wallet and then you hit the as you. <laughs> and once you click on your BTC wallet, you guys can actually see that. I am a user of Bitcoin. I don't just buy and hoard it. I actually buy it, I sell it, and I purchase things with it. I see, everyone that you see, every account that you see where I sent Bitcoin is me actually purchasing different items using Bitcoin over the internet, which I will show you guys in future videos. So if you'd like to see how to actually spend Bitcoin, 
make sure that you subscribe to this channel for future videos that are going to come out if you guys want to purchase bitcoin from your phone this is one very simple way of doing it and now i have one thousand two hundred and fifty seven dollars and thirty three cents worth of bitcoin in my portfolio so let's go to way number two one of the other ways that i actually use more than coinbase which will be binance that i use over on my laptop because i'm able to day trade it and i'm able to stake my coins to make even more money let's get into that way right now so once again um before i talk about binance also back in 2017 when bitcoin was on the bull run uh, most cryptocurrency sites had to go to a halt because they couldn't handle the capacity at the time of everybody trying to buy bitcoin so if you just want to set up account, it's completely free. Just set it up just in case Bitcoin gone another bull run. You guys won't miss out on the opportunity of getting in on that wave. But uh, Binance is another one. Well, let me show you guys how to buy um, cryptocurrency on this one first. And then I'll show you all the other benefits of Binance. So if you click buy crypto. And once you set up your account and enter all your information, you can do it straight from the site, just from the click of a button. How much cryptocurrency would you like to buy? If you want to buy 200, your bank card information is already in there. And then you just click buy BTC. But I just purchased my $200 from uh, Coinbase. So I'm not going to put in another purchase again right now on Binance. If I want to send over $200, I'll just send it from my Coinbase account over to my Binance account. So it's just that simple. The minimum amount that you're able to buy on Binance is $15. Um, so let me show you another reason why I love Binance. If I go to, if I click on markets, I am able to, I am able to day trade BTC USD. That is Bitcoin to the US dollar. And you're able to do it instantly. You're able to look at one minute charts, one hour charts, one day, one week, and one month chart. If you want to day trade, I personally look at the one hour chart based off momentum. And there it goes. This is one of the charts that come up. Bitcoin was up and it had a little drop and then it went back up to the 25 moving average line right there. So Bitcoin is going to make a play around this area right here. But yeah, if you're into day trading, you could pull up different charts on TradingView, look at Bitcoin and then use your Binance account to actually buy and sell your Bitcoin on Binance if you're a swing trader or a day trader, okay? And the next biggest reason that I absolutely love Binance, if we go to my wallet, is because of all the other cryptocurrencies that you're able to have on Binance. They have BNB, which is Binance on cryptocurrency, Tron, Win, and if you just scroll down, you're able to trade your Bitcoin for all of these other cryptocurrencies. It's 12 pages worth of cryptocurrencies. Let's see if I can pull up more. All right. So if you keep scrolling down, there's tons and tons and tons of different cryptocurrencies. So if you ever heard of a cryptocurrency and did not know how to actually buy those cryptocurrencies, you're able to do it on Binance. Just come on here, buy some Bitcoin, and then just trade your Bitcoin for all of these other cryptocurrencies that you think might explode in the future. So Coinbase only have a select few of cryptocurrencies, but over on Binance, they have 12 pages worth of cryptocurrencies that you guys could go on there and purchase yourself with your own money so so you ever heard someone talking about ripple tron uh litecoin ethereum dark coin you could come you could come on binance and actually purchase those cryptocurrencies yourself and own them in your wallet on your binance account the next reason that i actually like binance is because you're able to stake those small coins like tron I'm actually staking Tron. Let me put it up for you right quick. All right, guys. And the last reason that I like Binance is because I'm able to stake coins right now. I'm using Binance to stake Tron. I own about 400 tokens worth of Tron. So all you have to do is once you stake it, you pretty much lock it up. And then you get paid out at the end of the month based off how much you have staked up to a 7% annual income to 9% uh, annual income. And if we look at my, if you look at the history yield of the last one, two, three, four, five, six, seven months, they've been paying out 1%, 4%, 6, 6, 6, and 5%. If I look at my 30 day holdings, 
that calculate your holdings at the end of the day and then at the end of the month however much you had in your account that is when they reinvest it back at the end so it looked like this month i got paid out a total of two tron so as long as i keep holding these into my account uh i would come up with a seven to nine percent annual income at the end of the year worth of tron so that's all i have for binance if you guys want to check coinbase out the link is down in the description if you sign up and deposit money you get a free ten dollars and if you ever want to purchase any other different kind of cryptocurrency i also left the link down for binance to where you could purchase any other kind of cryptocurrency or if you wanted to day trade or swing trade but other than that guys make sure that you tune in and subscribe to this channel because i'm going to be talking about cryptocurrency more in the future especially with the big news that is about to happen so other than that i'm zeke bringing you the dream green show and i'm out peace